thousand million units. Two thousand million units. And for our hundred and two presently Mr. Chairman, that it gives me very real pleasure to be present at this memorable ceremony, <clears throat> which all Scotland has awaited with eagerness, and today watches with pride and acclamation. <clears throat> you have given us a vivid account of the benefits which this mighty scheme is bringing to the people and industries of Scotland. And you have rightly reminded us that the building of it has been completed in conditions which have often meant considerable hardship for those living and working on the site. Everyone will, I know, join with me in expressing the warmest admiration of those whose vision, tenacity, and technical skill have welded together in facing and conquering so formidable a task. Their reward will be to see new strength surging into the very arteries of Scotland's being. From this great enterprise on the banks of Loch Lomond will henceforth for a stream of power, bringing widespread benefits to the cities which it is to serve. No less compelling is the need of the villages and glens. To them, cheap electricity will be a lasting boon, for it will bring to those who live in faraway places <coughs> those comforts and facilities which have hitherto been reserved for the large centres of population. In Scotland, we want our rural areas to be equally flourishing and equally favoured. I am, therefore, very happy now to inaugurate this great service in electrical power and to declare the Loch Sloy scheme in operation. <clears throat> <clears throat> 